Most of the muscles that extend your wrist backward attach to a bump of bone on the elbow called the lateral epicondyle. Sometimes, through injury or overuse, the site where this common tendon inserts can become irritated or inflamed, creating a condition called lateral epicondylitis, more commonly known as tennis elbow. In spite of the name, the majority of those affected by tennis elbow have never even played tennis, but they do perform common activities, things that involve repeated wrist extension, like carpentry or construction, typing, playing the piano, knitting, or lifting objects with your palm down. Since you accomplish many of those tasks with your dominant arm, this condition is three times more likely to affect that side. The pain of tennis elbow often begins as a vague aching sensation around your elbow, sometimes radiating toward the forearm. Initially, symptoms are provoked by forceful gripping or lifting. But as the condition progresses, even simple everyday activities like holding a cup of coffee can produce pain. Without treatment, tennis elbow usually lingers. In fact, 80% of patients still report pain more than one year after onset. Fortunately, chiropractors have some very effective tools to help relieve your pain. Things like therapy modalities to decrease the irritation, and myofascial release to help break up scar tissue adhesions and loosen excessively tight muscles. Your chiropractor can also determine if a support brace is appropriate and show you the most effective home exercises in order to help prevent this problem from returning. But joint manipulation is your chiropractor's secret weapon in the war on tennis elbow. Research has shown that chiropractic manipulation of restricted joints in the elbow, wrist, and spine can provide immediate benefit and dramatically improve your treatment success. So if you or someone you know suffers from tennis elbow, Consider the safe, effective, natural alternative first.